Hello everybody, welcome back to Lasting Impressions, where we take on the second level in Kirby's Dreamland. I'm your host, Akuma, and today we're going to get through the second level. Lolo's Castle, I believe it is? This is another easy level, much of the same as the last level had, but there might be a little bit of increased difficulty this time. For starters, let's unpause the game, take care of that guy who's about to come hit us, and here we go. That was easy. Into the castle we go. This. That microphone right there. You'll notice I swallowed it immediately. Watch what happens when I try to spit it out. Kirby is so destructive. Into the store. Yee! I actually forgotten. The castle is a haunted house. We're playing Castlevania now. Mask. I don't know if I ever found a way to play with those guys. Oh, that sounds wrong. Go into the store. Mr. the ghosty. You notice that these mummies did not get sucked up right away. Or ever. Some enemies are actually impervious to Kirby's inhale ability. Oh, and hey, there's our uh, star marker. Boink. Off we go. We shot out of there like a torpedo. Not very far, though. And there is uh, Lolo as the mini boss. Yeah, Lolo's castle, and Lolo is the mini boss. And the mini boss dropped pretty darn fast. I guess we can't go in any of those doors. But, uh. Oh, don't worry. We'll get to see Lolo again. <laughs> Here's a bit of fun. I actually figured this out in my last playthrough. I must have skipped it the first time. First, I'm gonna grab this health. And you saw how I was surrounded by all those enemies up there? Well, here's an odd piece of little food. Watch what happens when I... Yeah. Normally in old games, when you're flashing, that means you're invincible. But no, in this game, it means Kirby's even more destructive. This cute little puffball is a freaking murderer. I don't know why I didn't just walk around the castle been so much nicer. Oh wait, that kind of explains it, huh? Here's the bat. Here's a little bit of a maze in Lolo's castle. Yeah, and by maze I mean vertical place. I thought that actually went to the right further, but I guess I didn't try that before. Ah! Oh, I got one. That is obviously not the door we're going to. Alright, these spikes here are a frequent staple in Kirby games. They are impervious to inhaling and damage. You can attack those things however much you want by speeding stuff out, by attacking them with Kirby's copied abilities in other games. They are indestructible. With one exception, which I will show you by the time we finish up this game. That was pointless. I'm gonna float over them and take this top door, which is off. Finally, we get some more. I don't know why that broom dude is even an enemy. I think he's like one of the worst enemies ever. Yep, here we go. This is the boss already. That's uh, Lolo and Lala. I don't know if that's... I assume that's his sister. But yeah, Lolo and Lala are the bosses of Lolo's castle. They each have three bars of health. We've got to suck up their block they're using and spit it at them. Enough time to get out of the way. Already, it looks like Lolo's down. Lolo's about to go. Poor Lolo. His sister's girlfriend's already gone. Dude, oh, jeez! <laughs> this level, this boss level can actually be challenging if you aren't sure how to fight him the first time. Actually, the second time I went through this game, I tried sucking up the boxes from the front and then speeding them out, which worked for doing damage, but you get hurt along the way if you don't defeat the enemy right then. So the strategy is to sneak behind them, suck them up from the back, and then spit them out of the back. And hopefully you can do that fast enough before they go in the door. Second level's already done. Let's get the star, do a little Kirby dance, and watch the next cute scene for level 3. Dance for me Kirby, dance!
still cute, though I'm not sure how that one was physically possible. Ouch. <laughs> He's adorable. In a disgusting sort of way. Well, thank you for joining me for the second episode of Kirby's Dreamland. Hopefully you'll come back for the third episode. And uh, if you did like this video at all, I hate to sound like everybody else, but uh, please, please favorite or like it. It'll help me get this series out so that more people can come across it and enjoy it for themselves too. Oh, Kirby dance time! He's doing the moonwalk. But yeah. Ah, there we go. If you uh, did like this video, do leave a like or a comment. Feel free to subscribe if you want. It'll help this channel get more views and He's so adorable. <laughs> and more people will be able to enjoy this series for themselves, too. So, thank you for watching. Come back next time for Kirby's Dreamland Level 3.